there are many symptoms of cervical disc herniation. The most common and earliest and most prevalent one is neck pain. And uh, patients will have pain not only in the neck, but that pain may extend down uh, to the upper chest area in the back uh, between the shoulder blades. And that is a very common uh, referral uh, location for the disc uh, pain to uh, spread to. It may also extend up to the back of the neck, causing headaches. But as it pinches a nerve in the neck that I've mentioned earlier from the disc rupture, uh, patients can have pain extending into the upper extremities, into the arms, and that pain may extend to the fingers, uh, and certain fingers that might be affected are those affected by different levels of the disc herniation. As well as the pain down the arm, there may be weakness in the arms, there may also be numbness in the arms. And that triad of pain, numbness, and weakness uh, make up the constellation of a cervical disc herniation.